Well, obviously it's disappointing. You know, guys are uh, disappointed downstairs, and we just told them don't be discouraged. You can be disappointed. It's okay to be unhappy. You know, um, but you know we're up eight four and, and uh, nine six, and you know the outscore is three zero. Yeah, I was worried about it. They came back in all the games. I think we talked about it during the week, right? They get, uh, I think, fourteen seniors in the team. We have four. It's, you know, it's a big difference, and, they, and their seniors did really well. Uh, Devin Dwyer was an outstanding player. Was five and two in the game, uh, and the game winner. You know, so um, uh, Harvard. You know, Harvard made one more play than us. Uh, you know, so we told our guys they, they, they played hard. We're not disappointed in, in the, the effort. We're not disappointed in most of the execution. Um, Harvard's a good team. They beat us fair and square. Devin, you said five and two. Morgan had one and five, and Joe had two goals. So how hard is it to contain those guys? Yeah, good. You know, good group. Uh, and, and, you know, twenty-four and, and thirteen are sophomores too. So there'll be a handful in the next two years. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, good athletes. Uh, great, great with the ball on their stick. Uh, obviously, Cheek. Uh, you know, dishing out those assists uh, was real important for him. The wire goes the other way. He's usually the assist guy. You know, so. But uh, yeah, it's a tough, tough, uh, tough group to handle. But I thought our guys, I thought our guys did well. You know, they scored a couple transition goals on us, which we were afraid of. They're a really good transition team. Can do. Was there anything you noticed in the fourth quarter that maybe Harvard did to get back into the game? They played hard. That's what they do. And for you guys, Buddy scored three more goals today. He had six last season, so what's it like to see that level of productivity? Uh, yeah, no, it's great, and, and you want that out of your attack. And I think every, all of our attackmen scored today. We, you know, we had a couple of opportunities. The other guys, uh, you know, Pete. Well, I thought that last shot was going to go at the end. You know, I thought it was uh, 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 an awesome job of composure by our guys right at the end of the game to get a shot off in that situation. You know, um, but yeah, buddy, uh, buddy played played well again so hopefully he can continue to do that and be consistent and six shots in the first quarter five in the fourth was there anything Harvard did defensively to limit you guys uh no I mean uh, we took five shots in the, in the in the second right is that what you're saying no five in the fourth yeah they had the ball they won face-offs three for three on face-offs you know so we have the ball as much as we'd like to in those situations mm -hmm. and with the short turnaround with the game Tuesday, how do you get the guys to just turn the page and get ready for Harvard? Yeah, that's that's what you do. You, you tell them, hey, listen, you, you know, once uh, once the afternoon, once you take a shower, once you come out of here, we're you know we've got, we've got to get prepared for Hartford. We beat us up pretty good last year. You know, fourteen eight, and it wasn't even close. It was fourteen three, I think, at one point. You know, twelve three. So, um, you know, I, I, I you know you, you, maybe it's good that you get a game on Tuesday. You don't have to wait the whole week. But we'll, we'll find out. Hopefully, our guys will be ready to go. Is there something in specific from in that very short turnaround that you're going to work on these like next two days or anything? No, you just have to prepare for your opponent. Yeah, and okay. you, you, you know, you're off tomorrow. Yeah, you got one day. <laughs> yeah, can't do it a ton. Okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was a tough fought uh, loss. I mean, Harvard's a great team. They uh, they fought us right to the end. We knew coming in here that they've had two close games. Uh, I think one overtime and one fourth quarter win, uh, one goal games, and we knew it was going to be right down to the wire. And uh, it was a good, good effort on our part, good effort on their part. They just came out with the W. Mm -hmm. And in that fourth quarter, was it starting to bring back some similar feeling to last year? Uh, yeah, you know, every game's different. It doesn't really bring back memories to last year. Last year was completely two di completely different teams, but this year uh, we just we couldn't buckle down on defense just enough to give us. Uh, that one goal advantage, and uh, yeah. And then the fourth quarter, what do you think? Was there anything they did differently to maybe? Um, no, not really. I mean, I think the one thing that they did is they stuck to what they did. Um, they stuck, they stick to what they do, and uh, we've seen it on film. We've seen everything. I think they were just going a little bit harder, pushing the ball a little bit more, a little bit hungrier. I think we got a little bit more complacent uh, towards the end defensively. Um, and sat back with that lead and almost got a little too stagnant with it. But it's something to learn from, it's something moving forward that we'll make sure we pay attention to and uh, make sure that never happens again.
Eric, with the short turn on Tuesday as a captain, how do you get the guys to turn that page and get ready for this one? Uh, we keep the energy up, you know. There's a lot of take out, a lot of uh, mistakes that we did out there that we can learn from, and uh, we got to watch film. We're going to get in here tomorrow, um, watch film, get something out of it, make sure we uh, right the wrongs. And uh, keep the energy up. They, uh, there can't be a slump with energy. We got to carry this energy over, just like we came off a win. Got to have the guys confident and ready to go on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. And just back to the game, real quick. Guys like Devin and Morgan and Joe. How tough is it to contain that trio? Uh, yeah, they're good guys. I mean, they're a great group. Um, we played before. Uh, we played against them before. I've been playing against Devin a couple times. Um, we knew what they had. We knew their uh, skills. We knew their strengths. And. Um, we just didn't buckle down. We just got beat today, and uh, it sucks being on that end of it. You just want to start with some general thoughts? Uh, you know, we came out um, pretty slow. Well, not too slow, but we came out in the second quarter. You know, we stepped it up. We took a lead, and we kept that lead all the way to the fourth quarter. And then we kind of took our foot off the gas a little bit offensively and just let up a couple of um, goals on the defensive end. And you know, they just came away with a win in OT there, so it's just kind of a bummer. We're just going to look forward to move on. we got a quick turnaround for Tuesday, so we just got to be ready for that game. Mm -hmm. And five goals in the second quarter. Was there anything you noticed that you guys may have done differently? Uh, we just kept moving the ball. You know, we stuck to what we do best, and it worked out. Just like as what happened against Ohio State, we did in their big second quarter, which turned out to lead into the second half and kept, kept it rolling a little bit until the fourth. Mm -hmm. And three more goals for you today. You've already surpassed your total from last year. So how's that feeling? It feels good. You know, it's it's nice feeling. But you know, I just got to credit my teammates there. You know, they set me up a couple <laughs> times today, and it was good, good all around team effort. But gonna come out of the W. Mm -hmm. And only six shots in the first quarter, five in the fourth. Was there anything Harvard did to limit you guys offensively? Um, you know, not really. I don't think they did play good D. They were flying around. And we just, sometimes we didn't take the shots we could have, and other times we just, they just, we just didn't pull the trigger for some reason. And uh, yeah, they just got out on our hands well, and they played good D. Mm -hmm. And I asked Kyle the same question, short turnaround Tuesday, how do you flip the page and get ready for this one? We just gotta, you know, make sure that we get ready for Tuesday by, you know, healing mainly. We got a lot of guys that are gonna be sore, we gotta get ready for that by just sitting down, not trying to, you know, go crazy in practice and whatnot. And, um, you know, we just got to watch film, get this, move on from this. This is a completely different game. We just got to look forward to the, yeah.